and welcome to a sold out Lamson Park. As you can see right in behind me, fans have already started to file in to their seats for what is a top 20 showdown between number seven LSU and number 19 Louisiana. Now last week when these two teams faced off, it would be LSU coming out on top with a four to two victory. So not only is this about revenge for the Cajuns, but postseason implications are on the line as well. Now, like we mentioned, LSU is ranked in the top 10 of the country, but their strength of schedule or RPI is third in the country. Meanwhile, Louisiana has the 15th best RPI, but their 5 and 12 record against top 25 teams is a sore spot. So a win against the Bayou Bengals tonight not only lets the Cajuns avenge their loss, but it could give them a chance to host a regional here at Lamson. And that's why Jerry Glasgow and company are dialed in for this one. You know, it's a big game for both of us, and we we both want to win. Uh, we both need to win for different reasons, but uh, I think if you look at LSU, they got a really legitimate chance of being a number three or four national seed, hosting a super, you know, regional and super regional, getting a top eight so they can host a super. And I think for us, it's uh, it would almost be a for sure thing to put us into a uh, hosting a regional if we could get the win. It'd just be a huge statement game for us and them. I think that we just have to approach it, like you said, from a standpoint, let's go all in, all out, and, and maybe roll the dice a little bit more. Now, first pitch for this matchup is slated for 6 o'clock. Coach Glasgow mentioned to us that he may make some changes inside the circle, so we potentially could see Sam Landry getting the start. We will have a recap for you tonight at 10 and updates on our social media. But for now, live here at Lampson Park, I'm Jamarcus Fitzpatrick.